In fact, the Polytechnic University campus has been seized for quite some time already, and we are extremely worried about the dangerous situation in the campus. So uh, the two important principles that um, I have uh, laid out uh, for the police operation, the first is, of course, to have a peaceful resolution as far as possible. This objective could only be achieved with the full cooperation of the protesters, including, of course, the rioters, that they have to uh, stop violence, give up their weapons, and come up peacefully and take the instructions from the police. The second uh, I have asked that the treatment to these underminers should be in a very humanitarian way. So uh, we have arranged for principals and religious uh, groups, uh, representatives to go into the campus to encourage and persuade these miners to come out peacefully. And if they uh, come out peacefully, we will just put down the their, their data. So we make a record of their personal data, and they may then leave the campus and return to home. We have not done any immediate uh, arrest of these underage uh, protesters uh, or other participants within the campus. But of course, we will have to uh, uh, reserve the right to undertake further investigations in future. At the moment, as far as I could gather, there, um, there were about 600 uh, people within the Polytechnic campus who have come out. About 200 of them are minors, and they have been um, subjected to the uh, special arrangements that I have just uh, referred to. And of the other four, 400, over 18, they will have, or they have been uh, immediately arrested. Whether they came out peacefully on their own, surrendered themselves to the police, or they came out using the various methods and were caught uh, by the police during this operation. A uh, hundred or so uh, people still on campus. So I made a very strong plea that um, uh, for every one of us who are concerned about the situation, uh, we will use whatever means to continue to persuade and arrange for these um, remaining uh, protesters to leave the campus as soon as possible so that this whole operation could be able to end in a peaceful manner and lay the basis for the subsequent work by the police to stop violence uh, in Hong Kong.